Yo, what's going on, guys? Yeah, man. So I'm super excited for this one. This is our guy Joe right here. Uh, basically, what I'm gonna be doing is just kind of doing an interview, just you know, asking him some questions on like you know how he's doing and all that, and kind of just dive into like his background, you know, what he's up to now, you know, his experience with the program, you know, running his Legion agency, you know, what struggles he's went through, you know, and what he's up to now and what his plans are for the future. So honestly, just kind of give yourself a little bit of an intro, Joe. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. Uh, what's up, guys? Um, so, yeah, uh, I joined roughly three months ago now. Um, time flies. Um Prior to the course, uh, I actually do work in digital marketing, uh, which was slightly helpful. Um, but before that, like I've been in and out of like entrepreneurial, like, you know, wannabe stuff uh, for a while, for like 10 years, because, um, you know, I hate the nine to five. So I was looking for, you know, what's the best way to get out of this, you know, the rat race and everything like that. I hate using all these cheesy lines, but that's really, you know, True. what you're trying to do. Yeah. Um, and, you know, I, I sold on Amazon for a while. I did, um, you know, try to do blogs, like websites, SEO, uh, you know, like Upwork, all this good stuff. Um, and, you know, they're pretty good. Um, but I was looking for something, you know, that I can do really long term and build an actual brand around um, and then get like, you know, recurring revenue uh, with like a reliable model. Um, and eventually I found uh Faison's YouTube channel actually I was like in, I was legit in the laundromat um just like scroll flipping through YouTube videos and stuff uh, I'm like a psycho for YouTube um and I went through a bunch of his videos and I was like this is like literally exactly <laughs> like this is exactly what I need and I, I feel like I signed up legit the next day um but it was like as soon as possible because I just was like this is it you know it just was like speaking to me um and it's gone freaking great ever since so um really pumped to be that's here awesome, dude. that's sick yeah like what what do you think exactly like was kind of spoke to you right like you're saying hey like you've tried all these things i feel like everyone is kind of in a similar boat like like i, I think we probably talked about it. it's like just like me like i did smma yeah. drop shipping stocks like all this stuff like it, it's not <laughs> really wasn't really like a reliable model right and then i kind of turned to lead generation kind of just changed my perspective on stuff so what about this? Obviously, you've had some success now, and we're going to talk about that. But what about the model and what about, like, me and the model kind of, like, stood out to you? It's like, this is the model I want to do, you know? Like, this yeah. is kind of this is what makes sense to me. Totally. Uh, so two things. Number one, like, you're so simple and straightforward. <laughs> like, it's, like, very refreshing, you know? Like, you get straight to the point. There's no fluff and, like, junk. You know, it's literally the concrete information uh you, you like you're like definitely like in the people's heads like and that's what i love about the course because the course also like teaches to be able to do that and i think that's like such like a wizard skill to be able to like know what your prospects are feeling and like thinking the decision process that they go through um and i feel like you just like literally crush it on like your entire presentation of the course the youtube videos and stuff the way everything is set up like you actually like it's very obvious that you went through all the steps you know what i mean because you literally talk us through it and we're like yeah fuck that's exactly how like i was feeling that's where i am now um oh, yeah. and it's just very straightforward and it just really speaks to the so, you know us that's awesome dude so like yeah talk to me about like what are you up to now right like you joined the program like you're in now like just tell us about like what you've done like how's the business right? Like, how's that going? Like, yeah. I know you had some exciting news. So just kind of give it, give it up. Yeah, man. Yeah. I don't even think I, I, I don't even think I told you yet, but I, I just signed my second client, uh, That's like sick, dude. today, what? like basically. So there you go. Just oh, laying what? shit out there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm like, I legit can't even believe like, like I like don't even believe it still. It's really like, it's such a strange feeling. You know what I mean? Like, that's it's crazy. like me mega like imposter syndrome for sure. Uh, but like, it's actually real. Like there's actually money in my bank account, like <laughs> from the client, which is insane. So um, I, yeah, so I started three months ago. Uh, I got my first client just a couple weeks ago, actually. So still uh, kind of in the onboarding process there. It's going outstanding. 
Uh, the client's super happy. I'm really happy learning a ton it's along the way. Like the terms of that deal too. Like how, how, how has yeah. it been going? Like what's the terms of the deal? Like how much are you making? Like what's the revenue there? Like just the terms. Yeah, totally. So the first deal um, was a thousand for like a one-time setup fee to get all the uh, software and everything squared away. Yeah, um, so there's a $300 uh, monthly recurring charge, like for the maintenance of like the tools nice. and kind of everything, nice. which you're is profitable. sick. You're profitable every month. Exactly. Perfect. Yeah, literally. And I haven't even gotten to like the calls yet, you know? So, and then um, $400 for call. Uh, which nice. is really nice for that so, for that first deal. Setup fee, uh, basically yeah. gives you like three months of setup fee already. So you're basically pro you you profit you're basically profited a thousand dollars on that deal like right after signing because the three hundred dollar tech fee is kind of taking care of that. So cool. Yeah. So a thousand dollars setup fee, three hundred dollar monthly tech fee, and four hundred dollars per call. So yeah, you book like five, you book like seven, ten calls a month. Like dude, you're making like three. Dude, I know it's yeah. just insane. Like. And I know, uh, you know, one of my goals this year is just to get enough clients so that I can get exactly what my salary is for my job and then just straight up quit that. Shit, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> see you later. Exact, literally the same exact thing I did. Yeah. Yeah. And then from there, like, it's just straight to the moon, like legit. But um, the day that I get that, which like is becoming sooner than I thought, like by the week. Um, like I w will not even believe it. You know what I mean? And I don't think like my family will either. <laughs> They'll be like, are you sure you're getting money? Like, like, yes, legit. Like, um, but it's just an amazing feeling. Yeah, no, totally. So very exciting. The second deal. Yeah. Did you just closed that today. Yeah. 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 I'll give, you know, I'll, I'll fill you in on like all the super tiny details later, but like the, de the deal is, um, uh, so it's a UK company. Um, so it's 750 pounds for the one-time setup fee, which is like I almost like a thousand, awesome. bucks, a thousand like, bucks pretty much. Pretty, yeah. Basically, yeah. um, 250 pounds, uh, a month for the recurring. So basically 300, uh, so it's almost the same deal, just slightly less for the calls because of the industry is a little bit different. So, it. uh, it's a little bit easier to get the calls. So it's 200 pounds for each call, Dude, that's which like is still nice. That's like 300 bucks. Yeah. Dude, exactly. Crazy. Yeah. So you have two clients, basically a thousand dollars profit on both of those, and you're getting yeah. complete uh, tech fees, which will profit a little bit off the tech fees too. But then you got um four hundred dollars per call for the first one, and then two hundred pounds, which, which is like two probably two seventy five, three hundred bucks, something so like, like that. Yeah, two hundred per call US probably per call total across all your clients. <laughs> so, dude, if you book t like ten calls for each client every single month, that's seven k a month. Wow, dude, it's just ridiculous. Yeah, That's like, amazing, yeah, I'm so pumped. Like, and like to be honest, like I, I'm like a fairly disorganized person in general, and you know, oh. I can, I feel like I can work a little bit more and do a little bit better. So, like, this is like, if you actually do exactly what's in the course, like if you make the number of calls, the number of emails and stuff, you'll be rich as fuck. Like in legit, like six months. Like it's for ridiculous like you know what i mean like i don't i like at the same time i want to tell people but then i don't want to tell people you know what i mean so it's kind of yes. like eh, i want all that cash for ourselves but you know i want other people too so you know, and like i want people to have a good life so it's uh, true man. The, the thing is about the program it's like honestly any program too it's like you follow the roadmap and you have the accountability and you have the support system like you're, you're gonna succeed yeah. it's about being consistent right like the roadmap obviously the roadmap that we have works you just have to actually follow the roadmap for a long amount of period of time for it to work yeah. and come out, right so i would even argue to be honest and i know this for a fact is like you're not even close to where you're gonna be yet because like you just signed your first two clients like now it's actually kind of where the fun begins of like systemizing stuff getting results getting those case studies and then that's where you yeah. kind of like start to really stack cash right because then you could just use those case studies and now you have testimonials and you have references that's exactly when you really that, right you snowball out of there yeah and you're basically about like you're basically at the point where you're probably going to get to like you know, seven, 10 K a month in the next few months. But then after that, you kind of lock in, you kind of sacrifice a bit of that profit. Right. And yeah. then really skyrocket because then now you could spend money on systems, systematize. Hell yeah. Stuff. You, you have to sacrifice a little bit of that, which is what I have to do too. So dude, you're in a yeah. great spot, dude, which is sick. Bro, I was like, I, I did this interview. I scheduled with you. I'm like, dude, he's got one client that's sick. Like, you know, he's got a good success. Yeah. 
Dude, what a perfect time. Boom, surprise. <laughs> yeah. I just signed a second client. So that's that's amazing. No, that was not yeah. that was not planned. He did not tell me. Yeah. I legit haven't told anybody yet. That's yeah. So, so very exciting. Honestly, next question I wanted to ask is like, what's like hmm. the biggest difference of who you are, like what you're doing right now, who you were before the program and after the program, like in your in your program mm-hmm. now. Like, and not just like the clients. So like obviously you have two clients now, you're gonna make a couple K a month, like you're gonna scale to 10K a month, whatever. That's awesome. But like yeah. has anything else changed like about like, you know, anything, like who you are or anything about your life, your situation, anything else changed? I would say um like I feel like I'm a more I want to say like a more mature person, but like a more serious person. Like I take this very seriously. Like, um, I like from the first day I signed up for the course, like I just told myself, like, I'm not gonna, you know, jump around to like a bunch of other stuff. Like I usually do. I'm not going to like, you know, get excited about every little side project that I find. I like legit put everything on pause, uh, which was very difficult and just went straight for it. Like, I feel like I'm really focused at this point and I feel like having my own, like, you know, quote business. I mean, I don't know why I'm doing quotes. It is a fucking business. Like I feel very, it feels very real. And I I feel like a professional, I guess, um, you know, I'm not perfect, but yeah, trying to learn every day now right there. Like you kind of caught yourself, right? You're just like business. Like, no, bro. Like, I was like, wait, it it is a fucking business. Yeah. Yeah. Bro. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's legit. You do this now, like it's serious, and it's like that's the biggest difference I find between like people who are kind of just like you know prancing around. I'll do this, I'll do this, I'll try this course, this course, and then they join something and yeah. have a community, they have a support system, and they're like, I do this now. Right? Yeah, the community is the best. Oh yeah, like the community is like the freaking probably the best part of the whole thing. Like having like if if there was no community, I don't, I honestly, I don't know if I could have done it. Like I need that motivation from like the people, like That's when cool. you have questions and stuff, like you feel like you're just on like friggin' Mars. Like if, if you don't have like people around you, like friends or group 100%. or whatever, having the people there is like, Oh, it's like the ultimate safety net. Like there's always people there who are pumping you up. Like there's people answering your questions, helping you brainstorm. Like people are willing to jump on a call and just talk through stuff or like role play calls and everything. Like it's, and you get to see the wins of other people. So it's like pumps you up and you're like, you know, it's like that friendly competition where you're like, damn, he got one. Like I'm going to get one. Hell yeah. Like, I'll show him. Yeah. But then the guy's helping you. You know what I mean? So like you're pumped sick. for each other. That's sick. Dude. That, yeah. It's awesome. Dude. I love it. So dude, yeah. what, do you, what, what do you think like the goals for the rest of the year? And I think you kind of touched on yeah. the job stuff, right? But like, what, what totally. You- <laughs> yeah. So, um, just like roughly calculating, um, based on like how much each sales call is going to bring in. So like 400 for the first deal, 200 for the other one, I think roughly. And I think you said it too, like seven, five to seven clients, I think is like probably the sweet spot where I can quit my job, like very comfortably. Um, so that's like my minimum goal and I'm trying to work kind of backwards from that point, um, to get, you know, cause I literally told myself no matter what, I am quitting my job at the end of the year. So there's that. Uh, so basically I have no choice, but to get to the clients, um, you know, I, I've been saying for the last few years that I'm going to, you know, do some venture and quit, but I haven't. And this year, like I am giving myself no option, like I'll quit the job. And if I don't have uh, anything, you know, if I'm not doing good enough, then that's on me. You know what I mean? Like, it's just straight up on me. So I don't think people understand how powerful that is actually. So it's like the burn the boats, the idea like, of burning the boats. So honestly, man, it, I did the exact same thing, bro. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> So <laughs> giving my story too, cause you remind me of myself, it's kind of like, if you don't put that pressure on yourself and you kind of don't go all in, you really don't make it. Because the thing is, yeah. is like human mind is very powerful, right? Whatever you kind of go all into, it's going to find a way to make it happen. So if you give yourself that safety net and that plan B, you're always going to, you're, you're going to end up there anyway, because you were too scared to go all in. Definitely. Right? So, every time, every what time. To me, dude, it was like I was working the job. I was living in, in New York city, like in Brooklyn, I had an apartment. And I saved yeah. up like 10 grand, right? I think I saved up like 10 grand, right? And like, yeah. dude, literally I joined this coaching program and I spent like 10 grand on this coaching program. And then I dropped, yeah. I literally left the apartment. I got some guy to sublease the apartment. I moved back with my parents. And then I scaled to 10K a month, <laughs> yeah. six months. And then I scaled to 20K a month within the next year. And I scaled to like 30K a month. And like, that's what, that's, that's, Damn, I gave myself the option though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
If yeah. you give yourself the option, you're always going to just go with the, with the uh, option that's more comfortable for you because we're we're well, human beings are wired for comfort. Like you're gonna be, whatever's yeah. gonna make you more comfortable, you're gonna do that. But if you don't give yourself the option, you're always gonna crush it. So, dude, that's why I know you're actually going to crush it. And the fact that you've already signed two clients is because you've given yourself that deadline. Like, dude, it doesn't matter if I have ten clients or like no clients. Like, at the end of the year, like I'm done, dude. Like I need to make. Yep. You know what I mean? So that, that's yeah. Like I don't think people have any idea how like powerful mindset is. Like people say it a lot, but I don't think people really understand it. Like literally, whatever you keep telling yourself and you keep thinking about all the time is exactly what's going to happen in your life. Yeah. So it's become like cringy, like the whole manifested and stuff. But like, dude, it's 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 really not because if you yep. But it ha your actions have to back it, though, right? I can't just be sitting in my bed. Yeah, you can't just repeat it. I don't mean like affirmations. Yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah. exactly. Like, like I'll be rich. I'll be rich. I'll be rich. Like yeah. you can read those. <laughs> like if you read those and you don't do the work, it's nothing. But if you read those and then you're you're like actually doing the work every single day, that's gonna yeah. like materialize in your head, and it's like, yo, I am the type of person that literally does this, and then that's gonna reflect yeah. like reality. People don't understand how how actually powerful that is until you actually go through it, which is what you're doing right yep. now, which is awesome. Yep. Dude, and exactly. awesome. last question, right, is there's sure. going to be people watching this. I'm going to post this on YouTube, right? So like, totally. what, are you, what would you say to people who are like on the fence, right? Like they don't know if they should do it. They don't know. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, I don't know if this is for me. I don't know if I'm going to make it. Like, what would you kind of say to those people? <laughs> And don't just be compliment me and say, hey, like, these I'm are not. Crazy. Yeah, okay. I was just thinking, I was like, I don't know if this is the exact answer, like, no, people no, want here, but it's like, don't I think the answer. Yeah, go ahead. I think, like, legit, the answer is like, if you're on the fence, and you don't know what you want, then you have to you have to make the decision. Like, if you don't make the decision, it doesn't matter if you buy the course or not, because you won't do it. You have to sit there and look yourself in the face and be like, are you actually going to do it this time? Or are you just going to do exactly what you did last time, find some excuses somewhere along the way, and then stop and like switch to do something else? Because there's like, there's no question about like the fact that the course fucking <laughs> works great. Like it's just straight up is like exactly what you need to do and exactly how to do it with the support system. And people who are literally doing it in your face every day, like that's not in the question. Like the question is, is like, are you actually ready to like have a new life? And it's like very scary, but like, that's, it's very yeah. good. Like change is so scary, you know? Also, so see, I think that's perfect, bro. Literally. It's like, yeah. it's not about program or the roadmap or this. It's always comes down to you. Are you actually ready to be a new person now? Like, are you actually ready to change? Like, if yeah, you're because people like, are gonna say shit about you. People like people, you're gonna have tons of people who are like, "Don't do that, do Like, you know, stay at your job, or like, this is probably a scam, or like all this crap. Like, you can hear that crap all the time, and it's oh. always like friends and family who start who start it because like you know they're worried that you know you might be making a bad choice and all this stuff. But it's like. You need to realize that you probably, like if you're watching this stuff, you probably think very differently from these people. They're not going to understand like your entrepreneurial mindset. It's a completely different life. And you shouldn't like try to explain it to them. You should just do it. Just show them. Don't talk. Just do it. Just, I sound like Nike now, but like they're <laughs> genius. Just freaking do it. Bro. Like sit down and get it done. Probably the best logo of all time, honestly. Because it, it, I know, it, I love it. it. <laughs> Yeah. So true, bro. Like, you just have to do it, bro. It's true. Rip off the yeah. bandaid. Go in. Like, it's not that scary, dude. Like, once you join, once you do it, like, you'll be like, oh, it wasn't that bad. And you'll thank yourself. Exactly. Because even if you fail at it and you actually try, you'll feel better than if you didn't try. Freaking 100%. And you'll learn a ton of shit. You'll learn a ton of shit about yourself. You'll learn a ton of new skills. Like you'll meet, you'll meet people, you'll get new partnerships. Like there's always opportunities that come from doing something. The worst possible thing you can do in your life is to do nothing. Like doing something always brings very well said bro. a new opportunity. So dude, this was sick. Honestly, we'll wrap it up. Yeah, it's pretty bro, sweet. What we're going to do is um, 
I'm gonna have Joe back on, guys, when when he when he actually leaves his job. When we get to that milestone, I want to do another. Oh, one. Hell yeah, one. dude! Just to be like, dude, like this shit works, and just you know, so you finally like live that life. I'm pumped for that. Actually, I'm gonna put that hell in yeah. my like little goal book. My hell yeah, dude. So next we'll interview. Do another, we'll do another uh, interview here when you finally get to that point, dude. And bro, Amazing. honestly, that we'll just end it here. And uh, bro, I'm looking forward to seeing you crushing. And looking hell forward yeah. to having you back on here again, so the guys can see see how far you've come. Fuck yeah, sounds great. Appreciate uh, you. Thanks a lot. Take care, guys.